Hey guys, today we're here with Winky because we're going to show you how we do our ferret's nails. So in this method, what are you going to need? Obviously nail clippers. So we use these stainless steel nail clippers. You can use like human nail clippers. I just find these work a lot better and are a little less rough on their nails. And then you're going to want salmon oil. So this is salmon oil from the pet store. Yes, it's in a plastic bag because this stuff, it's stinky. I actually end up putting it in these little eyedropper things. This way I can control it a little better and dealing with this is, I don't know, I just feel easier because no matter what you use, it's gonna be stinky everywhere. So again, I just find this easier. So to precursor, our ferrets actually did not like salmon oil. It actually took us basically taking little drops and putting it kind of along their gums and getting them to lick it. This took like a few weeks and eventually they decided they love the heck out of it. So, so if they don't like salmon oil, you may have to work on that first. But we're just going to flip the winky over and salmon oil. Again, you're going to end up with some stinky, stinky stink everywhere. But while he's busy, we're just going to take and clip, clip, clip. Clip. All done. Roll. It's really easy because he has these white claws. So you can just see the pink in there and that's the blood supply. You don't want to clip the blood supply. So we always come just short of clipping that. <laughs> I would personally recommend doing their nails once a week Ferret's nails grow super, super fast. I was actually pretty surprised on how fast. Okay, so as you can see when he's licking me, he's ran out. So we're just gonna, we're just gonna do this again. Oh, you're a mess. You do not have to bathe them after this. Again, they're gonna be a little smelly, but it's okay. They'll clean themselves off. But again, once a week I find is perfect so they don't get too long. Otherwise you risk them getting caught up on like their hammocks and bedding. And if they get stuck, Obviously, it could be very, very bad. So once a week is always good. It's right here, buddy. It's right here. So yeah, that's all there is to it. It can be pretty simple once you get them liking the salmon oil. And it's so much easier to do than a squirmy, wormy little ferret. Like little Winky can be all the time. <laughs> so I hope this helped. Thanks for watching.